In the middle of the night, I'm craving for something sweet, so I'm going to make some apple crepes with this Japanese Fuji apple. And I actually already made some crepes in the afternoon, so all I have to do is just pan fry this apple with coconut oil. For the crepes, I used one cup of rice flour, one cup of almond milk. One cage free egg, and I added a little bit of coconut sugar. Those crepes are pretty healthy because they are gluten free, sugar free, and dairy free. I know I sound like a health nut, but I used to be a sugar addict. I used to drink a lot of soda, and I used to love to eat cakes, ice cream, and milk chocolate. I had been suffering from ongoing fatigue and constant headaches, and every time I had headaches, I would just take some painkillers. And whenever I felt tired, I would just. Eat or drink something sweet to feel better. I was addicted to sugar. Sugar is like a drug. You already know sugar is bad for you. It's hard to quit, isn't it? Sugar releases opioids and dopamine. It's why you feel so good when you eat it, but it doesn't last long, so you have to take it again. Several years ago, I did some research on sugar, and I found out that sugar could affect your mood. I knew that if you eat a lot of sugar, you could get fat, or it could be the cause of diabetes. But I didn't know sugar could affect your mood until then. It all makes sense now because I used to feel depressed for no reason, and I learned that sugar could weaken your immune system too. In Japan, we are very concerned about the spread of the new coronavirus. And I believe that the best defense against the disease is a strong immune system. So I have been trying to avoid sugar as much as possible. Hmm, the crepe smells so good. And I would highly recommend this apple crepe for those who have a celiac disease, or someone who is allergic to gluten or dairy, or someone who is lactose intolerant or gluten intolerant, like me. I'm making myself some rosehip tea. Rosehips are high in antioxidants, particularly vitamin C. As you can see, I'm using this maple syrup for these apple crepes. I normally use maple syrup, honey, agave syrup, or coconut sugar for the substitutes for sugar.
Mm, that's so delicious. Tonight, I'm going to open this present that I bought for myself for Valentine's Day. I left this present for a while because I didn't know what to write. Anyway, let me tell you about it. This is called Present Book. Let's say you are giving this little book to your boyfriend. Then you write down 100 things that you like about him. But I bought this book for myself. So I'm going to have to write down 100 things that I like about myself. I can easily say what I don't like about myself. But it's not easy for me to say what I like about myself, which is sad. Okay, let me try. I like myself because I never give up and I always bounce back. Hmm, this is not easy. I'm already stuck. I don't know what to write. Okay, next, let's see, I like myself because I'm good at creating a cozy living space. Oh wait, I almost forgot that. I wanted to display a set of dolls for the girls' day. March is just around the corner, and we have a holiday for girls called Hinamatsuri in Japanese. It's a special day for girls and their families, hoping for a bright future. And we usually display a set of dolls that are wearing the traditional Japanese costumes for the day. I would definitely display the set of dolls of the emperor and empress if I had them in this house. However, I don't have them. My parents have them. So I'm just going to display these serving ladies in the imperial court with this nice scroll and the flowers of peach blossoms. No one would display those ladies without the emperor or empress. This is very me. I don't follow the rules because I like to think freely. But you know what? I know what I like about myself. When I was younger, I wanted to be loved and accepted by everyone. I thought it's their job to do so. But I know it's not. It's my job to love myself and accept myself. So let me try again. I like myself because I can think outside the box. And one more thing. I like myself because I'm no longer afraid to be myself.